2014 Super Air Nautique 210. Just took this boat in on trade. Color scheme on this Voltaic yellow and black. So accent there in black uh, with your black Chromax on there. So sitting on a color match Voltaic yellow tandem axle trailer. Some nice black rims on there. Uh, we obviously have the black flight control tower with the Nautique Bimini up top and then four JL speakers. Uh, but we'll take you around this boat and show you the excellent condition this thing is in. So we'll start around the bow. Boat's in really good shape. So we sold this boat new originally back in 2014 and have serviced the boat ever since. So we're very familiar with this. Gel coat looks really nice. Chromax looks sharp. Now, if I see anything, I will obviously spot it out. Um, you know, as you can see, the trailer's seen some some stones along the road, so you'll see that. Um, that's just what's going to happen when you're trailer in this boat. The hull looks really nice. So keep walking down the port side. Looks like we do have a bit of marring on the rub rail there, but that looks not really that bad. You do have a slight, slight little scuff right under the, uh, right under the fuel. And all right, we'll keep our, keep making our way. Do you have a bit of, a bit of paint chipping on the back? trailing edge of the trailer but um that's the trailer the boat is amazing it looks like we have oh no just detail uh platform has uh, definitely seen the sun um it's a slightly different shade than uh than this this yellow but it's it's really hard to tell um just a little bit more faded you have a chip here probably getting gear in and out of the boat and you'll see the sea deck definitely looks like this on a trade-in. You just got little chips and scuffs here and there. Minor, if you'd ask me. Um, just small little nicks around. It's gonna happen. Uh, boat has NSS surf system on it. Transom straps. Props in good shape. All right, so oh, I need to take you around this side. Ooh, we'll get a peek at that black interior deck. So just one more time around the starboard side. Love the color of this boat. One thing I do want to mention here, in this black top stripe, do have some scuffing. It looks more like a small gouge right under the, right under the windshield there. So I don't know what that could have been, but it's tough to see. All right, one last exterior look. Uh, tires are in good shape. Uh, let's see. I'm trying to find the year for you. 23s, so pretty new tires. All right, let's jump on in. Take a look at the interior on this 210. Besides the Besides the platform having a couple scuffs here and there, um, other than that, I mean, the, the sea deck walking in is really sharp. So you have your little lift, lift ring in the back, lights walking in. So here we are on the back of the 210. So interior scheme, tungsten gray with that voltaic yellow accent and black carbona. So have a slight little texture um, add in here. That'd be the Carbona. So obviously gray sea deck. So as we step in, take a look at our board racks. Pretty cool custom racks. Uh, you got that voltaic yellow with the black forks. Same on both sides. That side needs a bimini, or not a bimini, needs a bungee. All right, so take a look under here. So have nice, Nice storage in this boat. Got your little storage cubby over here. And then uh, obviously ballast on both sides. 
The boat has 1,150 pounds of ballast. Um, so two rear tanks and a belly tank. All right, and then the motor is the PCM 5.7 liter, 343 horsepower. Really clean engine compartment. All right. It's nice and wet from detail. All right, interior. Really good shape. So I'm going to take you around, just try and show you some defects maybe, but honestly, just the way this boat will shine. Uh, this thing looks super good. Um, didn't quite mention yet, but... Uh, the boat has 370 hours. So you can definitely tell by the condition this boat is in now. So storage on both sides, open storage. And then you have this little snap in seat here that you can remove and sea deck is underneath. Should you uh, want to walk on the sea deck instead of your uh, center, center cushion. Uh, port side lean back is removable. So you can just pull it out of its tracks there. Same thing with the starboard lean back. So you can pull those out if you want to open up the space even more. Um, but I mean, just taking a look at this vinyl, it's in really, really good shape. JL audio throughout the boat. And then we do have a Polk audio sub right next to the driver's seat. So really clean inside. Tower folds forward. Take a look under our OB seat. Got your batteries, dock lines, throwable, amps. Storage, plenty of storage. Glove box here. Got your Polk Audio head unit. Clear space in there for any of your stowable items trash can door here and then you have your battery switch location so here at the helm taking a look at this driver's seat really good shape you do have a bit of the nautique logo fading out um, but it's all original and really really good shape take a look at the back all right hydro gate lever there so this does, this does have the uh, link screen. And so through the screen, you've got, obviously you have your uh, navigation. It looks like this one does not have it. So you can upgrade to that if you need. Uh, third button is gonna be your music, user presets. It's gonna be your courtesy options. So lighting, overhead lights, docking lights, which I forgot to mention on the walkthrough. And your heater. <laughs> and it also shows you all that stuff here. Ballast. Like I said, 1,150 pounds. And filling them all individually. And this will show you engine hours. 371 engine hours. Keyless ignition. Blower. Nav lights. Bilge. Horn. Stop. Steering wheel's in really good shape. And a nice mirror. All right, so we'll walk into the bow, take a look at that. One thing I do want to mention here, you do have a bit of something, looks like something nicked the tint on the boat or on this uh, walkthrough windshield. It's, it's very small, hard to notice. Vinyl on the, vinyl in the bow really really clean probably fit one to two comfy up here removable bow filler if you'd like to remove that and we got some cup holders under there so four cup holders in the bow plenty of storage under each of these seats so storage there and then likewise around so and good step pad, sea deck up front. All right. Bimini with your nav light shining up top. So if you have any questions about this 
2014 Super Aeronautique 210. Give us a call at N3 Boatworks, 317-845-9253.